Hey, what is up guys? Welcome to a new Kev5 tutorial on how to fix your Multiverse Portals plugin. More specifically, the error is the internal error. An error has occurred while attempting to perform this command. Now, the command in general is this, uh, and these include all of the Multiverse Portals command. I am going to attempt to create a portal, and I'm going to call it YouTube. As you can see, this error will appear. Many of you have requested that this be fixed and you don't understand how to fix it. Well, today I'm going to show you how to fix it. Now, to explain the issue at hand first, the issue is that World Edit 6.0, the latest version of World Edit, does not work correctly with the latest version of Multiverse Portals. So if we actually go over to the Multiverse Portals page itself, you will see the latest version is just a bunch of random numbers, obviously. <laughs> but for some reason, the latest version of Multiverse Portals does not work with the latest version of World Edit. Now, to fix this, there's two things you can do. You can go far out of your way to actually install the 5.6.1 version, which is um, it's it's how I fixed it anyway. You can also install 5.6.2, I believe, as that will also fix it. But if you don't want to go out of your way to do all that, if you don't want to install a different version of World Edit and you want to have the latest version of World Edit, there's actually a fix for multiverse portals. I will provide it in the description below. But basically, all you have to do is simply download this, install it, and put it in your FTP. Now, you may be asking, what is this? That is the multiverse portals fixed version, which I provided in the description below, as I will repeat again. Now I will show you how to install this version really quickly. Uh, let me pause the video for a second and get it downloaded. Now that it is actually downloaded, as you can see in my download bar on Google Chrome, you will want to do the following. I am using an MC Pro hosting control panel running Pixelmon as an uh, example of how to install this. Now you're going to want to go to your FTP file access on your Multigraph control panel. Uh, I am sure this is pretty straightforward if you have other hosts with other types of FTPs, of course, um, generally just go to your FTP, however you would do that. Once you are in your FTP, again, multi um, MC Pro Hosting actually has an extremely nice and laid out FTP that you can access. Now you're going to want to go into your plugins folder. Once in your plugins folder, if you don't already have Multiverse Portals installed, you would install this version. If you do have it installed, you can leave the, leave the folder be. You're actually going to want to scroll down and find your multiverse portals jar whatever it may be named you're going to want to select and delete that file now you're going to want to hit upload and simply drag and drop from either your downloads folder or your download bar which it will work for my download bar in this case now you're going to want to go back to your control panel and hit restart we are going to have a short intermission while the server restarts once your Multicraft panel has come in your server has completely started up, you will see this green icon generally in the top left corner of your Multicraft control panel. You can also see in console where it will say it's completely done, uh, everything is started up. Now you're going to want to go back onto your server, which uh, is right here. You're going to want to wait until it loads in completely. And now we're going to show you that it does work with the new version of, or of Multiverse Portals. We're going to select select two points, and we're going to do slash MVP, create, and let's call it YouTube. Now, as you can see, the portal has now been created. There is no errors shown at all. Now, I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope this helped you out a lot. I've known, I know a lot of people have had issues, an immense amount. Um, while you're at it, if you would be willing to, uh, feel free to hop on my Pixelmon server. We love new players all the time. We are indeed looking for staff, but please do not join the server asking for staff. You have to earn it. This isn't a server that gives op and staff for free. You must understand that. Um, the server is laid out very nicely. Um, it's all around just a great server. We're working on the gym and the professor's laboratory as we speak. And the shop has been completely redone. As you can see, everything looks beautiful. I still need to fix a few permissions issues, but we also have mob drops all labeled out so you can sell and make money really easily. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope this helped you out a lot. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you are new or if you enjoy and this helped you out. Uh, thank you guys so much and have a wonderful day.